Where is Lisa? Do we still want to do the band? Mm -hmm. Why do we want to do it? What do we want to do? What do we actually like? Also, I want to clear up something. Hey, I'm Christina. I'm Amy. I'm Lauren. And, and we're, we're Cimarelli. Cimarelli. Part of it. Cimarelli. Yeah. <laughs> we are sisters and we love to make music together. We upload our videos on Cimarelli Saturdays at 11 a.m. Eastern time. So we're just going to jump right into it. So today's video, we're gonna talk about why Kath and Lise are not in all of our videos. We're gonna tell you guys the projects we're working on right now. It's just like a life update video. And we're gonna talk about like our personal lives. So let's jump into it. So here's why we're making this video. We uploaded a cover of Beautiful Things a couple weeks ago. It's going really well and there were so many comments of the same theme on there, which was, where is Lisa? Why is Lisa not in this? Where is Lisa? Is Lisa not in some rally? Blah, 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 over and over and over. And that was like the one video in a long time, maybe a full year, the one video that we didn't say. Oh. Lisa, we, we didn't say- Cause we didn't talk in it at all. Yes, in every single video we have done for at least the last year. Then we say, Lisa is not in this video today if she's not in the video because she's supporting her husband through his cancer treatments. Mm -hmm. So that's been going on for quite some time now, but Lisa is in and out of video. So when it works with her schedule, she loves to come in and be in the videos. And then when it doesn't work with her schedule, then we just do the video. Lisa and Kath coming up are in some videos, not in some videos. Kath is on maternity leave right now. She is having her third child, her third boy, and she's on her maternity leave right now. So it's actually a really exciting time why Kath's not in the video, but <laughs> she'll be back in several weeks, I believe. She'll be back in some videos. So if you want updates on Lisa's husband, Chad, and how he's doing, go to his Instagram. He posts his health updates on his story and his feed. So if you want all the information, go follow Chad. So with that being said, please keep Chad, Lisa, their daughter, their whole family in your prayers. Please, please, please. I've been saying that in every single video we've done except for the last one. And seriously, they do really, really appreciate your prayers. So thank you guys so much, everyone who has been praying. Thank you so much. So our schedule on YouTube also has changed. We have so much to catch you up on if you haven't been here, which is what we realized in our last video. A lot of you guys ha who hadn't watched a video in a while, watched that video for the first time in a while. So we're kind of here trying to catch you up. Mm -hmm. At this point in life, in 2024, I'm 30. That is not real. I'm 33. <laughs> That's Cass, not real either. Cass 32. Lisa's 30. 30. I'm 28. And I'm 25. Oh my gosh, we're I, so old. 20 thrive. <laughs> Love I that can for you. never remember how old you are. 20 great? I because I, here's she the thing. switches her <clears throat> age. I gaslight the people. I've been almost 30 for like three years. Yeah. So also, I have two children. Kath has three and Lisa has one. So there are six little, little Cimarelli girl children running yes, around as well. they're so cute. So it's pretty wild around here. Basically at this point in our lives, we really like reevaluated, like, do we still want to do the band? Mm -hmm. Why do we want to do it? What do we want to do? What do we actually like? And what we landed on was our number one thing we realized is original music. We are all the most passionate about writing and putting out our own music, number mm -hmm. one. But also we are very passionate about video just not necessarily every Aesthetics. single week. Every single week doing a video. Yeah. That is, is we a lot of work. That's more for like, in your 20s, if it was just Lauren. Just young and Lauren, single. Lauren, yeah. Yeah, that's like in your 20s, Without child. way easier. Yeah. At this point, we're like, that's not a realistic schedule for where we are at now. So we're like, what is realistic for us? I'm gonna update you on our current schedule and then also the other projects working on our other channel. I don't even know if you know about it. So basically all the things going on are, there's our Cimarelli channel and there's our podcast channel. People who love the podcast love the podcast. It's called the Cimarelli Podcast if you haven't watched you it. You really stay up to date with us if you're in on the podcast. Every Wednesday on our Cimarelli Podcast episode, we upload a podcast. So if we you want to really, share, like. really want to stay up to date, that is definitely the way. On this main channel, um, we're not doing weekly uploads anymore. We're kind of doing 
kind of what we originally did. We'd mm-hmm. be like, is there a song we want to cover? Are we coming out with a single? Is there a video we really want to sit down and shoot like this? Mm-hmm. And when there's a video we really want to do, we put the video out. So we don't have a schedule anymore, but it's still Saturdays. Mm-hmm. So then our new project that not all of you know about. So because we have kids now, well, not them, but you yeah, know. Yeah, I don't have one. We you. started a kids channel called Sim Kids. And this project, like, I feel like it lit all of our souls on fire. It did. It really reinvigorated It us. was like a new, like a missing piece in the mm-hmm. whole Cimarelli universe, basically. Because, mm-hmm. like, we get something really fulfilling out of Cimarelli, and then we get something else really fulfilling out of Sim Kids. And it has helped my songwriting and producing so much. I produce most of the stuff, and then, like, we will write a lot of stuff together. We're writing a lot of original stuff for it, which is really fun. It's just so fun. I can't tell you how fun it is. We have, like, fun outfits and, like, I don't know. We Wigs. use... We, we use like... <laughs> she has a wig. Everything that we learned from Sim Rally, we applied to Sim Kids. And it's just so cool, like, seeing your own kids and your, like, nieces and nephews dancing along to stuff that you made and, like, really enjoying the videos and the songs that you put out. On that channel, Sim Kids, um, it's a lot faster and easier to put songs together. And it's more just, like, simple. Yeah, too. it's simple, low pressure, and also it's new. So we are getting a schedule on that where I think that one's gonna be weekly because it's a lot easier because you can do like the same video in multiple different ways. So like Mm -hmm. you don't have to re-record everything and then you can do compilations, which I as a parent, I need. I live and die for the compilations. So Mm -hmm. it's a lot easier to do the weekly uploads there. So we're gonna do, I think we're moving towards that schedule. Weekly uploads on Sim Kids, and then on Simarelli, we are just trying to do like what we are really, really passionate about. We don't just be like, oh, we have to throw up a video now. I think we were kind of getting to that point where it was like, what mm-hmm. do we do now? Yeah. And we want it to be like, if you watch our last video, Beautiful Things, we that put- That was not thrown no. anywhere. We put Never. absolutely so much not. <laughs> The amount of time we put into arranging, recording, yeah. rehearsing, filming, everything, we put so much more time into that, and we were mm-hmm. so much more passionate about it. Oh, yeah. And I think that it shows. It, it shows. I mean, it shows to me. Yeah, we did so much extra effort for that video that I don't think we've done before, in general, all mm-hmm. that effort for a video. So that's what we want Simarelli to be. We are, we are so passionate about Simarelli, and we really want it to be these projects that we really put more time into. Okay, now we're gonna tell you about our original music album and then personal life kind of updates, I guess. So we are working on our album right now. We have a lot of songs like already written and like Mm -hmm. partially produced. So we're really, Really coming along on that. It's, I'm I'm so excited. Oh, it's so exciting. And we posted a few song promos on our TikTok, so we will insert that right here. I'll forget.
So we did a full Similarly podcast episode on the album. If you want to go watch that, it's going to be linked in the description. If you want to see us talk all about the album process and like yeah, where we're at. And what songs we're thinking of putting on it and yes. stuff. Yes. We really went into a lot more details. Pretty cool. Yes. So we do have our next single picked and that is Don't Think About It. We did a live version of it like two videos ago if you guys want to go watch that. And this is a song that we wrote like, or I guess I wrote. Yeah, you <laughs> I wrote, wrote it. it <laughs> like did you. 10 years ago. Yeah. It was a while ago. A while ago. I've been begging. And we played it at a show. And then we you guys... It, yeah, San Jose. You guys begged for it. You and guys. It's kind of crazy. We posted it, like, on our story or something. And then we got so many DMs, like, oh, my gosh, I've been waiting for this song. I'm like, I cannot believe... I kept trying to get people to pressure her into letting us do it for of, years. I just can't believe fans of that song are, like, still... Like, waiting for it. And I love the way it turned out. It's so cool. It's so, like, um, like, like, nostalgic kind of sounding. Yeah. And, like... Uh, Sounds like, like a movie. Yeah. yeah. Like, and it's, it's... Like, oh, if I... Okay, like, crying alone in your car, yes. driving But and it's, like, like, really beautiful at night. Oh, like, it's really oh, good. Like, yeah, really pretty, like, a summer night, and you're, like, in your car, and you're driving, and you're, like, why I'm doesn't so he good. like me? Oh my gosh, it would hit so hard. If you're going through a breakup or just like a situationship breakup or like Ooh. you like someone and he just won't, he just he won't. He just won't. He just then won't. <laughs> this song is perfect. Look, I'm married, okay? And I'll still listen to it and just be like, oh. What is okay, happened? also I want to clear up something about the lyrics because some oh. people think that it's like, um, like serious. Like, oh, I just won't think about it. But it's Wait, you what? telling yourself, like, like they think the lyrics of the verse are, like, like dead serious. Of like, oh, if I just push him out of my head, like, oh, Wait, I'll forget what? everything. What did people say? People commented that about the lyrics. I'm no, just saying. No, I say. unfortunately. They were just like, I don't think that's healthy. Like, you can't just say you're not going to think about it. Oh, not think about it. But no. it's, you, it's you trying to tell yourself, like, I'm just not going to think about it. And it's showing how when you try to say I'm not going to think about it. You're like, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. Because we've all been there of like, no, I'm just not going to think about it. I'm going to yes. move on. But it just never works. Guys, it's tricking yourself. You're just like, I won't think about the sound of his laugh. Guys, it's yeah. in the song. So, Don't Think About It is coming out on... <laughs> Woo! Yay! And yes, Kath and Lisa are on the album and they are on Don't Think About It. Yeah, we're not going to do like original songs or things like that without one of them. Like, that's like... Everyone's on those. Okay, lastly, we're just gonna talk about like our personal lives, where we're at right now, because I know a lot of you who are watching this, you haven't seen anything in years. Okay, I feel like mine's the easiest. I already told you, I have two kids, I'm 33, and I'm gonna have more, more than one more for sure. When am I gonna have the next one? Don't know, but I'm not dying to get pregnant right now. Mm -hmm. I would like to have a little bit more sanity. Having a one-year-old and three-year-old, it will get you. So I'm, I would like them to be just a little bit older and a little more sane. I feel like Barrett's getting more sane as he gets older. Mm -hmm. Also more powerful. <laughs> so it's scary. <laughs> but anyway, so that's kind of where I'm at. Um, okay, I'll just say for the people who don't know, um, just what you might not know. Work on your music? Yeah, I do like a solo project that I've been doing for like the last few years where it's just me. I don't have to listen to their opinions. <laughs> oh, love it. I can just Solo do memes. whatever I want. Love um, it. So I've been doing that, working on that. I'm actually working on my own album. My Amen. Second Two album. albums at once. Perhaps third album, second album. I don't she know. She has iconic music, but you probably already But the videos, it. you gotta check out those videos. Yes. Yes. I did like a whole music video series for my alb where it's like... The alb. <laughs> they all the alb. like string together in one story and it's like 30 minutes long, so... It's for it so good. good. You gotta Pretty check it reading. out. And I am like a producer now. <laughs> So I produce, produce like most of our stuff. And, and she mixes and masters. Mixes yeah. and masters everything. And I do all that for Which is no too. small feat. I also um, have my starring role in the big screen coming up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm in a movie that's coming 
yeah, I don't know when it's coming out at this point. It's called Triumph of the Heart, Oof. but look out for that. Who do you whenever play? Whenever it's coming out. I play Mary, the, the mother, mother of God. God. The mother of God. So that was interesting. I went we to Poland. And then I begged to go yes, with her. Amy came with me. We went to Poland. I was like, please, let me come. And then I did. To film that. That I was, was her assistant. Really crazy. Uh -huh. I feel like my my life doesn't have that many twists and turns. It's more just like vibing. working on stuff, you know. It's like working and vibing, you know. Um, Hanging single, with the gals. In case anyone's interested. Um. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're not the bachelorette, people. What about you? I'm pretty much vibing and attempting to be thriving. Uh, okay. you know, what am I, 28? Not gaslighting 20 people great. about my age anymore. I'm 28. Um, I am husbandless, childless, <laughs> really living that independent life. But Amy's the number and one babysitter? I am yes. number She's one child care always provider. always watching our kids. I am very talented at it. Amy so. is it like is. their first... Um, name that they say basically. All Truly, kids. actually, so but I think annoying. it's a fluke because it's so easy. No. Yeah, my name's so hard. No one can yeah, say Yeah, try it. to get him to say Yours Lauren or Christina. Come on, it's hard. Krista? Um, <laughs> you do get a Krista Cass, and a Lorna for Cass 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 Cass. Cass. She's really out on the I'm town. very on the go. Oh, I um also not in anywhere near any level as Lauren, but I am. Working on my own production and music. Oh, yeah. Amy I only have like six songs. I have six songs release. I've been sitting on for like eight years. So or like make five her years at this them. point. Yeah, make me release them. Um, I'm getting close. Ish. I have to browbeat myself into recording for them. So browbeat me into recording my messaging me. But they're really good, I promise you. And I'm getting into some more production actually for Don't Think About It. I did mm -hmm. part of the production, which is really cool. I've never been able to like be um, producing anything on any of our stuff before. So that was really cool. And I did some guitar on it. And I also did some guitar on our Beautiful Things cover, which is cool. <laughs> And so I'm just like doing that, um, painting ish. She loves to paint. I love painting. I am an artiste. I do want to do some more prints. So that's like my goals that I don't do, but I want to do. Amy and I are on TikTok, just saying. We are TikTok. Post I have a ever. TikTok. I, I want her to post. On it. I try to entice her to post by posting about her and tagging her. She won't her, do but it. She won't do it. You post on your Instagram story. She does. Though. Her Instagram story is good. I'm scared of Instagram, good. so. Oh, okay. All right, that's pretty much our full life update at this point. Yeah. Um. Once again, you can check out Summer Life Podcast if you really want to stay updated. And also our TikTok. We um, are mm -hmm. so. Up, like updating, active on TikTok, do a lot of random and stuff. Instagram, Instagram yeah. and TikTok. That's we're, where we're showing like the behind the scenes, the yes. making of our album, especially. Like yes. we're gonna be posting a lot of that. So if you want to yes. be informed, aka a prize, a prize, to, <laughs> to keep yourself <laughs> apprised of all the updates. Well, that guys, is. um, I think that's get out, get out. That was Lisa. That's that was for you, say. Lisa. <laughs> All right, we'll see you in our next video. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Thanks, 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 thanks for watching. watching. We, we love the Sim Bam. To not feel hopeless in life regarding romantic relationships. It's gonna change and you gotta embrace where you are.